welcome back to breastfeeding boot camp day eight we're going to be talking about how to hold your baby and get things done around the house while breastfeeding if you can hear it i am pumping got my wearables in right now <laughs> if you're a breastfeeding mom i definitely have struggled before with you know getting things done around the house with a traditional pump and being plugged into the wall but ever since i switched to my wearables if my baby falls asleep i can hold her i'm just up i'm moving around i'm doing exactly what it is i need to do and i'm not being restricted let me lay her down really quick because she's so tired hold on all right i'm back and actually my pumps just stopped so i'm gonna go ahead and go into the kitchen and dump these out so i can prepare bottles for later on and i'm gonna be answering some questions about what you can do if you feel like you're not producing enough breast milk for your baby so in the series we talked about how to increase your milk supply with pumping and making sure that you're on a frequent pumping schedule that's definitely going to be key when it comes to increasing your milk supply I breastfed baby on this side, so you will notice that my supply, I have about three ounces on this side. Um, but again, if you're looking to increase your supply, you wanna be pumping frequently. That can be while you're nursing baby on the opposite side or in between nursing sessions. Another thing to do while you're, let's just say you your supply has completely diminished, you can do combo feeding. Now combo feeding is something where you can do half and half. So there are moms who take half the breast milk of what they are able to produce, and then they take a little bit of formula and they mix it together. Um, I had to do that with my twins. I've been successful with being able to produce enough this time to where I did not have to combo feed, but I did experience combo feeding before with my twins. I wasn't producing enough to feed two babies at the time. I wasn't even putting in enough hours to produce and get my milk supply up there looking back if i was more educated on supply and demand and had the right support i for sure would have been able to feed my twins solely off of my breast milk not that combo feeding isn't good it just wouldn't have been my first choice but i felt like i didn't have many other options because one i simply hated being stuck to the water pump and not many people around me were breastfeeding at the time no matter what your choice is remember that baby being fed is best and you want to make sure that you're doing everything possible to make sure that they eat cheers this is Muscle Up Mommy J35. If you're looking for an amazing wearable breast pump, I definitely recommend because you can pump anywhere, anytime, on the go, at home, at work, in the car, and you're not restricted. So I definitely recommend the Muscle Up Mommy J35 wearable breast pump. Do what you will with that information, and we'll see you back tomorrow for Breastfeeding Bootcamp Day 9.